April 29th. Legends will rise. Kenzie Morrison versus Haseem Rahman Jr., Steve Cunningham Jr., Keith Hunter, and Robert Daniels Jr. Only on pay-per-view. Ronnie, yeah, is that the crunk style? And and it, and no disrespect, but I just had to um, I have to not give I give Javen a little bit of credit, but you're not really crunk because <laughs> your that was your uncle, the late great rest in peace, Emmanuel Stewart. But you was like the kid that just sometimes came to the gym and you know hang out and watch. <laughs> But really, it's your version of Kronk. You do you understand what I'm saying? It's not. It's not Absolutely. the real Kronk, like Ali Bashir and um, who? Uh, who's the other guy that is the big OG even for you? Uh, Tommy. Uh, guys, help me out. And he was on Troy's you show. You cannot tell me Tommy Brooks. Yeah. He what he's a he's a part of that. Well, he, he, he no, no, he he never really was with Manny Stewart. No, he weren't under Manny Stewart. It yeah. was it was James Ali Bashir. We'll get onto him yeah. anyway. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we would say so that's Kronk. Javon's not Kronk. He's Kronk adjacent. <laughs> right. You know. So it's kind of like his version. It's like me coming to your gym. <laughs> hanging out for a couple of years and going right. I'm 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 Ronnie Shields. Uh, this is Ronnie Shields' uh, way of training. Yeah, it would right, be right. Ronnie Shields' way of training, <laughs> but it's still with sh doing it the Shan way. If you right. understand what I'm saying, it doesn't Absolutely. make it. It doesn't make it like the pure Ronnie Shields way, unless me and you are both doing that same train. We're training that same trainer. I know. I mean, that exactly. same fight. Art. Yeah. Exactly. Otherwise, if I've just hung out with you for four years, just say, you know, I've hung out for four years and I, I'm like, Frank's uncle Ronnie, right, I'm going to train this guy. It's right. not really, I can't really claim it to be just like, have you got a, specific, a, a particular style name, Uncle Ronnie? No, not at all. No. All right, we got to make one up now, man. You're done them season. <laughs> yeah, done them there season. you go. Yeah, that there means... Stop them. That's what it means in Jamaican terminology. Finish. Done. Okay, so done them season was yours. So I hung out with you, learned I've seen you do the done them season style with the fighters. And then I'm like, all right, I'm gonna do done them season now. Yeah, but it's not, it's Uncle Ronnie's. It, right. It's not really mine. Exactly. Do you understand? Because I'm doing oh, yeah, my method. Yeah. So really, Javon, you're not really crunk, but you a little bit of crunk. But where I was right. going with this is that. Do Kronk, you can put me up on game. I know Kronk because Javen always says, we, you know, it's uh, offense, so we're going for the knockout. Is Kronk <laughs> about the sweet science as well? Well, Kronk is about the sweet science. You know, I, 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 used to fight, I used to fight all the man used to fighters when I was in the amateurs, you know, Tom Hearns and a few other guys that, that were there when I was coming up in this amateur. And, you know, I used to talk to Emmanuel when I started training fighters. I used to call him up all the time and talk to him about certain things that I had trouble with, along with my mentor, George Benton, you know, mm -hmm. and especially when I got on my own, you know, I always called and asked for advice. And Emmanuel always gave me advice on how to do certain things as well yeah. as George Benton. But if you look at Tyson Fury, he fights nothing like the crunk style. Nothing at all. Tell me why, because I, yeah. I won't know. You, <laughs> he doesn't. You, why, he doesn't do anything. He doesn't do anything that Emmanuel Stewart would teach, put it that way. So, you know, they can call it whatever they want to call it, but, you know, nothing has changed. It's, it's all the same. He, he's the same guy he was before. Now, Sugar Hill, you know, that's yeah. Javon. Yeah. He... You know, obviously he's showing them some different things, but 
when you look at it, no, he doesn't have the crunch style. <laughs> when you look at it, no, you don't got the crunch style. So what is it no. then? So what, are they just trying to sell us like it's pretending to be crunk, but it's not really crunk then? Of course, that's all it is. It's just, it is they're just pretending that, that that's what it is, but it's not. You know, if you if you look at, go back and look at a Tommy Hearns, a Hilma Kintick. Which I have, yeah. Do Tyson Fury do anything like those guys? No, absolutely nope. not. No, nope. Absolutely nope. not. So absolutely not. Those were the real Kronk fighters. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Could you teach Kronk? It's, I can, absolutely, Ooh. I can. But, you know, you have to have a certain style that, if you if you notice, mostly all the mainstream guys was tall and skinny. Yeah, I was going to say that. Yes. So the majority of them, that's what they were. So he was able to teach the crunk style to them easily. And I knew it because I used to fight all of his guys. So I knew that style. Yeah. So, but Tyson Fury definitely doesn't have a crunk style. Absolutely not. Wow. So, well, this is a good news report for tomorrow. <laughs> you don't have crunk. Wow. You don't. Have, so, well, this is a good news report for tomorrow. <laughs> you don't have crunk. You don't have it. That's why I'm not allowed at their press conferences. <laughs> they never give me media clearance to go to a Tyson Never. Oh no, my god. I just know that no, not her. She's gonna just say the reels. Yeah, okay, so he doesn't have crunk style. Epic. So what style does he have? Because this Tyson Fury that we saw with Deontay Wilder, if you look back at the old Tyson Fury, great fluidity, great, you know, he's got the herky jerky, the good faint. Right. You know, he can switch it, but I think he more south pause just to show that give you yeah. a look of it. But um right. That Tyson Fury, I feel, has to come to fight Dillian White. That Tyson Fury better come to fight Dillian White. <laughs> if he gets it on the chin, we know he can go down. Yeah, we know he hits Walter the count. Proved, proved that. You know, the thing about it is Fury, you know, he doesn't look like he's all in great shape, but we know he is. He's got an engine, you know? yeah. And, and that's why he gets up, because of his shape, you know? But, you know, <laughs> Dylan White punches just as hard, if not harder, than Deontay Wilder. Yeah, with the so, combination, because he's a combination. Absolutely. He that yes. left hook, right hook, left hook, yes. uppercut as well. And if, if, I tell you something, if Dylan White comes in great shape, he's going to give Fury a lot of problems. He really is, That's because of his style. He's not Deontay Wilder, who, who right. only looked, at, looked for one punch. Yeah, Dylan is going to throw punches with both hands. He's going to let them go. You know, Wilder, Wilder just look for one shot. Yeah, and, you know, it it, up. you it, know, it great. Work him. It worked yeah, for it you. Worked yeah, for him for a long life. Time. Yeah, Absolutely. yeah, yeah. Good, good. Kudos to you. You, you yeah. know, you didn't have the biggest talent, but April 29th. Legends will rise. Kenzie Morrison versus Haseem Rahman Jr., Steve Cunningham Jr., Keith Hunter, and Robert Daniels Jr. Only on pay-per-view.